Welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be swapping out the envelopes in my cash envelope wallet and this is the wallet that I use for everyday spending. I just pretty much change it over to this one because I did have a zip around Kate Spade and then also I do have um, a little bit of cash. It's not a lot but I like to stuff whatever I can. I did sell some stuff on the Facebook marketplace so we're going to take that little bit of cash and I'm going to be putting that into my 50 envelope challenge so I'm just going to be placing it wherever I can and wherever it'll fit but first things first guys my name is Tina I'm a cash budgeter I do the zero base budgeting system and I also use cash envelopes to help us get closer to being debt free to pay off some of this credit card debt well not some but all and to also you know what I'm saying just to be able to save money and then also to use your paycheck instead of using it for credit card payments or loan payments that's all I want. All right. So um, is that something that you want to check out and see? Please stay tuned. Let's hop into this, guys. Okay, so this wallet right here, uh, my last video I did post it and everybody was asking me, where did you get it from? So you guys know I don't mind sharing where I get things from. And I did get this from DH Gate. Um, it's like, honestly, when I ordered it, I pretty much ordered the wrong thing. I wanted the color that were the dark brown was all over and the tan was just here but when I got it out the package it was nicely packaged it had the box it had like the tissue paper it had the cloth and everything and I will show you guys all right so this is what it came in it came in this and yeah y'all it is like super legit and I already took everything out and then um this is the paper that it came in and then I know I'm supposed to be doing the other video. And then this is the little dust bag that it came in, right? And then it came in with some of these little um, inserts, but I'm not going to use it. Maybe I might use the little um, sheets to write notes down or something. I'm not sure. And then um, it came with, y'all, this is um, Aiden's little M&M wrapper. <laughs> that boy. Um, it came with this little card. It came with this little um booklet yeah so this is all the stuff that it came with so like i said um it was i don't have the money to buy um one of the you know i'm saying the luxury ones um because i just want to just try it out to see because i do like that i've always loved the design of it but um i don't have the money to spend like 900 dollars or whatever on like a planner agenda but like i said if you do like i said kudos to you and i am like shoot i'm like go girl because like i said if you want to get something for yourself because you work hard for it i would say go ahead but you know what i'm saying just for my situation um i because i still have like a lot more debt that i need to pay off and so i just went ahead and i just got like a little dupe one um but it's actually really it's actually really nice quality i was kind of shocked um because at first i was like uh, i got the wrong one i was like no i was like wait a minute I was like this is actually kind of cute and you can kind of see like it has the the button there and then this little right um keychain right here I just got this from actually Staples because I thought I was going to get the dark brown one so I was like that would go good with the cherries but I did print this with this and um because I had some free um points so I got that for free at Staples all right so um what we're going to do these are the envelopes that we are going to be switching over these are turned the wrong side so i just kind of did it in this color to kind of you know what i'm saying to kind of make the colors kind of go a little bit together um so i will be keeping this because this right here is what i use um to put my check register in because yeah i'm old school y'all i keep a check register so <laughs> i know old school right so i do keep that there so that's why that is gonna stay in there and then um these are my cash envelope breakdown slips where you can like and i just take these and i just stick these back here too so that's another reason why um i keep these and these right here in my etsy shop and then also on my website um they're sticky note pads they come 50 to a pack um and i don't know if i'm gonna keep this or not all right i'm just gonna because it's like i just put little things in here but i'm gonna actually i don't know i'm not sure yet all right, so this is my deal with this one. I'm going to keep the coins because there's no, like, coin pocket in here. So these are the ones that I had. And 
Um, there is nothing wrong with them, but I just wanted to kind of like have the colors go a little bit more better together. So, um, we're going to just swap these out. So this is just a bank run. This is just when I have extra cash to go back to the bank. I have some extra cash right here. This cash is actually the cash that I'm going to be actually stuffing for my 50 envelope challenge. And I don't have anything planned for the envelope challenge. So like I said, I'm winging it. So it is what it is. <laughs> All right, so we're going to put that right there. So next for our grocery envelope, we're going to stick that in there. And then on the back here, I have a pocket that I actually put on the back. And the reason why I did this was because um, this is my deal with this. So the cash that we're going to put in here, I'm trying to figure out ways to kind of make it easier like when I'm in the store. Because you guys know like when you go in to the store... And you're at the register and then you're trying to write your stuff down. You're always in a rush and you got to put this and that in there. So you're just like rushing. So I figure that if I do these cards because they're pretty small enough, I can just put it in the back. And then if I need to pretty much write something, I can just use this. And these are pretty, um, you know what I'm saying, hard. So I can just lift it up and just go ahead and write down what I need and then just slide it there. It's easy to access and easy to get to. All right. So next I'm kind of, I don't know why I'm sitting it in there, but I guess I'm just, I don't know why I'm putting it in the holes and then I have to take it out, y'all. Just an extra, y'all know I'm extra. <laughs> Always got to do these extra steps, all right? All right, so we're going to do that. And, and then this one goes in here. So like I said, it makes it so much easier to um, access. All right, so I guess let me just go ahead and put this money in here and then and then put it in the holes because what I'm doing ain't making no sense. <laughs> All right, so that is that. And then I remember I had cut these down a little bit to fit inside of these envelopes. So now I should be able to just leave it the same way that it is because it should fit. But I do like how low that is. Actually, that does work out a little bit better. All right, so household got there, got, and then that goes there, and then we'll have to start from the back here for budget to start putting them on that side. All right, so we got beauty. All right, where's the budget? Budget, budget, budget. Oh, yeah, budget. I don't have anything in there, so. Let me do this. So, um, I have not been outside today, so I'm not sure what the weather is like. And because usually, like, on Sundays, I try to, like, rest a little bit. I mean, I get stuff done, but I try to rest so that I can be prepared for the busy <laughs> weekday. Because when the weekday starts, I'm like going, 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 going. And Sunday is like um, pretty much my rest day. So I'm not, I'm going to actually, I don't know why I'm putting this in here. I'm going to actually put this here. And then I'm going to put this here so I know that I have it. All right. Yeah, so that's why I, I try not to do too much on Sundays which isn't Sunday supposed to be rest day anyway. <laughs> All right, so we got 20, and that goes in there, and then that. Yeah, this should be a lot easier for um, when I'm at the store. All right, Dollar Tree doesn't have anything in there. Yeah, I know y'all probably like, she's spinning, I don't know why I keep putting this in here. She's spinning all, I'm so used to putting it inside. She's spending her money on a luxury planner. I'm like, uh-uh, y'all. But yeah, it's kind of like, sometimes it can be kind of hard to kind of order from there because if you're just new to using it, I had to like, seriously, like figure it out. So it's not, I mean, it is not easy because um, some of the stuff is, the pictures are kind of like weird. So you have to like figure it out. All right, so... I don't, like I said, I don't know if I'm going to, the rings are pretty small, but they have it where people have been changing out the rings 
they have actually been putting like Moterm rings in there and um, like old planners that they've had. They've been putting those in there. So I don't know. So if this ends up giving me like a hassle or anything, I might um, put another um, binder ring in there. I guess rings, binder rings, right? Um, I might put another one in there. So I'm just going to ride with these little small rings here because these things look like they're about like 12s or 19s. But um, so this is what we got for our um, planner. We have bank run. Um, we have groceries. We have gas. We have Aiden. We have, we have household. We have personal. We have Dollar Tree. We have beauty. We have eat out. We have budget. And then I did keep the coins back here. And then this thing also have like a little, um, it has a pin loop in it. Um, I don't know if this is, I can't tell if this is like leather, but it's actually smells. I'm going to show you guys. It actually smells really good. Can you guys see that? Oh my God. I hope you can get, I'm trying to get a close up. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. I promise. I'm trying. Yeah. If you can just see that and it smells, I don't, it looks like it's leather to me, but, but the listing said it wasn't leather. So I'm not sure, but, um, yeah, which is, I don't know. But it actually closes really, um, really nicely and it feels good. And these envelopes here, I did make them to go all the way because I wanted it to kind of fill it. So I did make it go all the way to the end. That's why I said these probably won't fit in another planner. These are going to be pretty much specially made for um, this little planner right here. All right. So we are done with switching the envelopes. I told you guys this was going to be quick. Super, super, super quick. So I'm going to like scoot that over here. And we are going to do our 50 envelope challenge here. All right, so I'm going to grab my boxes and we're going to open those. And I need to get my little cards. So, all right, so my cards are in this little binder. This little binder here is one that I made myself. Um, so, and then like I told you guys, so you can kind of compare and see. I'm going to do this real quick. See how much smaller these are i mean it's not too big well i guess it's not too much smaller yeah i guess it's not too much smaller but it is smaller because i just did it like that because i wanted like i said i wanted this to be full um full with that all right so i'm going to go ahead and grab my 52 52 not 52 weeks 50 envelopes um savings challenge cards so we're going to see what we have um to actually do this and these little boxes guys you can make these yourself um i just went to staples and i just got like the little um, index card boxes and then um, i just went to the dollar tree and got some little blinged out stickers and i just put them on there i know a lot of people have been asking me if i want to put these in the shop um you guys let me know if you would like me to make them and put them in there and if it's like enough people that say they want to do it i might end up putting in there and then um like I said, I just made the little envelopes to go inside of it. So, um, you guys let me know what you want. <laughs> All right. So, we got 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. And like I said, I sold some stuff on the Marketplace Facebook. Um, and this is just like extra cash. So, I figure I'm just going to go ahead and put this in here. Because like I said, last year, I did not complete it. And I didn't do, I'd, I mean, I didn't even like, like, I don't even know it's not even it wasn't even like an attempt that in my mind that it was um how i looked at it but so that's why i want to like try to do it a little bit better so um i'm just gonna look on here because as you guys know last time aiden was like the timer went off and he <laughs> had to go back and he was like I, i'm gone i'm out of here all right so we got 10 20 um let's do 21 22 all right let's see let's do i'm trying to figure this out Let's do 21. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to find 21 and I'm just going to put that sideways. So we're going to mark 21 on here. And I just do these cards because I do, instead of doing the 100 envelope challenge, I do 50 and 50. Um, you can basically do it however you want. There's no right or wrong way with your budget. Um, because everybody's budget is pretty much different and everybody has a different journey. Um, but you can also, I mean, it's still, you can like see somebody else's journey and be inspired. 
but um like i said just because you don't do it 100 envelope challenge doesn't make it that your envelope challenge is wrong or anything like that all right so we got one two three four five we got five ones so let's do 10 20 um let's do 10 11 12 13 14 15 maybe we'll do 15 and maybe we'll do 20 all right so 5 10 1 2 3 4 5 okay so we'll go ahead and do 15 for that so we'll do this 15 and i'm just picking whatever color and these pins right here are um, friction clicker pins the erasable um and i do have a link in the description box um on amazon for these so um because i know i've been getting questions on where did i get those pins all right so we got 15 so we will put this in here so we are actually doing good with this as you can see we've been pretty much doing pretty good stuffing um what is this one i got that right what is this 5 10 11 okay i just took it out and i didn't even look and see which envelope it was doing too much all right and um, that's the one i just put in there so i'm gonna squeeze that a little bit all right so the next thing we're gonna do is 10 we're just gonna do 20 and maybe i'll do i'll do 20 in this one so we're gonna do 20 how about that Yep, 20 will be fun. Do, do, do. Okay, so 20, and we will put 20 in here. And we'll do it like that. All right, so I'll put this back. 18, 19, 20. All right, so we got that. So that is what our 50-50 envelope box is is looking like well boxes not box so i'm going to go ahead and put this back in here so as you can see this is what we got going on so far and i put these in here so i won't lose them and plus all of my cash is in here so this helps me keep up because i was losing these little cards every now and then all right guys so thank you so much for chilling with me through this video and we are pretty much done so let me know uh, in the comments how your challenges are going if you're doing the 50 50 envelope or 100 envelope um so i would love to know and then also guys if you did like this video please give it a thumbs up because you know i do appreciate it and like i always say until next time guys peace